cut myself. Real bad, too. I need to get myself some band-aids. Hmm, what do I got? What do I got? Well, regular band-aids just ain't gonna cut it this time around. Oh, ho, 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 I said cut it. No, it's just not gonna, it's not gonna work this time around. I'm gonna need some serious band-aids for this, this problem of mine. I think the only thing I'm, that could probably remedy this issue is the bacon strip adhesive bandages. I didn't actually cut myself. I'm setting up for the review. I'm telling a story. I'm saying, come on in, guys. I've cut myself. This is the setup for what the product was. Today, we're going to be looking for this random spot on the bacon strips, adhesive bandages. This channel is, seems to be getting notorious for bacon-related items. <laughs> I didn't plan it. I didn't plan it. Somehow, it just ended up working out that way. But we're looking today at the bacon strips, adhesive bandages. You get 15 die-cut sterile strips. 15 of them. Perfect for cuts, scrapes, grease burns, because you might get grease burns when you handle bacon. I've been there. Or other minor boo-boos. Absorbent, non-stick pad, long-lasting adhesive. Even my cats are excited. You can hear them in the background. They're going on. They're saying, bacon strip, adhesive bandages. We're totally there. They'd say that if the cats could talk. On the side, caution. Packaging of this product contains natural rubber latex, which may cause allergic reactions. So if you are allergic, my friends, to latex, maybe you might want to stay away from these adhesive bandages. Oh, there's a free prize inside, too. Oh, well, there you go. It's the large size. By the way, I think it was also the only size. I don't think there was any other size available. Three inches by one inch. Apparently it tells you how to apply a band-aid. Very crucial. Speaking of band-aids, hey, what's going on over there? I, they're really getting excited about these band-aids. Speaking of band-aids, speaking of what would require you to use a band-aid, let's bring in Hank into the equation, shall we? I'm gonna get this opened up. The irony, and I shouldn't even say it. I'm gonna wait. I'm going to wait. You probably will know where I was going to go with that. But saying it would have only jinxed it. Okay, I think we're alright now. I was going to say the irony to using Hank to open up, to open up a container of Band-Aids. Quite ironic, if you ask me. I, you know, if I was, if I wasn't too careful with this guy, I certainly would be in luck because I would be reviewing these guys. Let's get this opened up, the adhesive band-aids inside. Where's, first of all, where's my prize? Let's find this prize that they speak of. Oh, something fell out. What do we got here? What is this? Let's put this down for a second. I know you guys are already interested in the band-aids, but hold on a second. Hold, hold on a second there. What do we got? We seem to have got... Hey, hello, 1984, how are you? We apparently got a sticker. A bacon strip sticker. This guy's happy. Look how happy this guy is. He's walking out on the town, minding his own business. Careful though. Don't don't tick this guy off. Don't tear a strip out of him. <laughs> no? Alright. Anyways, let's just keep reviewing. I said hello nineteen eighty four because this is like the do you remember the old foamy stickers? They're adhesive, but they were kind of padded. Remember those? I do. Nobody? How old are all you people out there? <laughs> Apparently not as old as this guy. But you get a sticker. Not bad. That was my that was my free prize inside. Let's put it away. And let's have a look at the sterile adhesive bandages. Sterility guaranteed unless wrapper opened or damaged. See that word right there? See that word? I can tell you, I've never used this word in my entire life. Very unlikely I would ever use this word ever again. Sterility? Who knows? I don't know. We're not here to be educated spot. We're here to look at band-aids. Bacon band-aids. On top of that. Get this opened up. 
Apparently Spot doesn't even know how to open band-aids. We're not in good we're not in good standings if Spot can't even open up a package of band-aids. Can you imagine if I was bleeding everywhere and I had to stop, fumble around trying to get these band-aids open up? Could you imagine? You would just hear a thump. And then my hand would just go like this. I'd probably like pass out. Again, I shouldn't joke about that. Alright, inside, it's exactly what you would imagine it to be. It's a strip of bacon. Oh, delicious bacon. Mm. I wonder if that's unicorn bacon. <laughs> Some people who are watching this video for the first time who don't follow my channel probably have no idea what I'm talking about. Now, I gotta say, that's a small piece of bacon. Quite small. If I got that in a cafeteria or a diner, if you will, I probably would look at it and say, hey, wait a minute. Six dollars for a breakfast? The big breakfast? And this is, this is the kind of bacon you give me? At any rate, though, it is definitely a picture of bacon. Quite delicious looking bacon, I might add, too. Now, I'm gonna pretend I actually did not cut myself. I'm gonna pretend, not to cut myself, I don't wanna pretend about that kind of stuff, but I'm gonna pretend that I have a boo-boo. I'm gonna actually put the Band-Aid on. Um, with any other Band-Aid, unless you've never cut yourself in your entire life, maybe you're that guy from Unbreakable who just never gets injured. Great movie. We're gonna peel off the backs. Got a small pile of garbage just on the side here. You don't have to see it. We're gonna apply this Band-Aid, pretending, of course, that we've injured ourselves. And look at that. It does lose something, I guess. The fact that you've wrapped it. It doesn't quite look like bacon anymore. I guess maybe it does. It also does look like the surface of Jupiter. But kind of neat, though. Now, certainly the biggest problem I would have is the fact that you only get 15. 15 bacon band-aids. Now, I probably would hold off until I was really, really injured, or if I kind of felt like putting a piece of bacon on my finger. But I certainly would not waste these. I don't remember how much they cost, but I certainly would not waste these on just regular boo-boos. And if I, if I had friends over and you injured yourself, dude, I'm sorry. I probably would not give you the, the good band-aids. I wouldn't give you the good stuff. I would give you probably just the, the regular, the regular band-aids. But very cool though. I am certainly glad I picked these up. And the fact that it's, again, bacon, you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong with anything that's bacon, bacon related. Today's random spot, show it off spot, right there. Today we were looking at the bacon strips, adhesive bandages. You get 15 inside and you get yourself a free sticker. Hello, 1984. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more random spots to come, and I will see you guys next time. Mmm, bacon strips.